so we give everybody a better understanding of really what this is. It's not a quick snap of a finger. Uh, in the room, I worked with about 10 people. They were able to relax the fastest, the quickest, the most susceptible. Doesn't mean that the people cannot be hypnotized. But obviously, for the time that we had together, they were able to relax very quickly. The cool thing is, is that I was able to give them some post-hypnotic suggestions to put themselves back under. So just to let everybody know, we were about 20 minutes in a room working. This is not something I can do. I can walk up to you on the street and do that. Right, I right. wouldn't be here now. <laughs> I'd be buying lottery tickets, a lot of them. I'm not kidding. Anyway, so um, thanks so much for, uh, for uh, stopping what you're doing here to have a little fun with us right now. So I'm going to ask them to relax and go back under. I gave you some preconditioned uh, suggestions, the key words, things that I use every single day, even whether, whether I'm doing a motivational program or a comedy show. The same words help us relax. So just want you to focus and relax. Just take a deep breath of air. And just let it out slowly. It's pretty simple stuff. I'm going to ask you just to focus on your breathing and just relax. And if I can, can I shake your hand? Mm -hmm. And Andy, three, two, one. <whistles> relax way down. Deep, deeper, relax. Hi, Jennifer. How are you? Just have, focus on your breathing. Three, two, and sleep. <whistles> relax way down deeper. Let every muscle collapse. Let yourself go way back under. Now, they can hear me. They can hear you. They know where they are. They just don't care. They're in a very relaxed state of concentration. But when they're in that state, the mind expands to possibilities beyond just the relaxation. In other words, a suggestion can become a reality. I'm going to do that now. You talked to them over an hour ago. Yeah. An hour later, this happened so quick. Yeah, because they wanted it to happen. Okay. I can't challenge them. I can't force them. It's that, you know, the greatest hypnotist in the world is ourselves. What we say to ourselves, we create. Simple stuff. So, well, in essence, I didn't hypnotize them. They put themselves under. Look how relaxed and comfortable they are. So let's go right into it. I'm going to open their eyes, welcome, back, uh, wel uh, welcome them back, but I'm going to place a couple suggestions. When their eyes are open, I'm going to say a couple key words. Every time I say the word Atlanta, every time I say the word Atlanta, uh, Andy's phone is his shoe, and it's going to start to ring live on the air. His phone is his shoe. He'll take off his phone, tell the person I'll call him back, and put his, his phone back on, meaning his shoe. Do you understand? Nod your head. So his phone will ring when I say the word Atlanta. His phone is really his shoe. Jennifer thinks that's the most ridiculous thing she's ever heard in her entire life. She cannot believe Andy's doing this here. But every time I snap my fingers, Jennifer will stop and try and get my attention. She just wants to stop the segment. She doesn't think this is funny. She thinks this is a waste of time. Uh, she's in control. Follow me? Got okay, it. Okay, so I say the word Atlanta. His shoe rings. It's his phone. He'll take it off, answer it. Jennifer thinks it's hysterical. When I snap my finger, she doesn't think any of this is real. Okay? Mm -hmm. One, and we'll do something again really funny. One, two, and three. Welcome back. How you doing? Good, good. Welcome back. How you feel? <laughs> feel well rested? How do you, I do. How do you feel? Feel... Happy. Jennifer, you were never asleep? Never unconscious? You heard everything going on? Yeah. You didn't care where you were? No, surprisingly. <laughs> yeah, same. It was uh, just, I feel really relaxed right now. Oh, cool, cool. Yeah. Well, we'll get to some fun stuff in a minute. We were talking, and so I'm at the punchline tonight here in Atlanta, my hometown. Hey, Ricky. Ricky. I get to Ricky. actually experience. Ricky. Yes. Ricky. Yes. Ricky. Hey. Yes. Can yeah. I, I, Ricky? I'll be I'll right just, with you. No, anyway, no, wait, 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 so uh, if you've never had a chance to experience anything like this, I hope you come see me live, not only here in Atlanta, but around the world. Ricky. Uh, you can actually, Ricky, uh, can we're, get, we're, we're, we're right in the middle. Of, we're, what's you, going on? I thought you, what, what's up? I'm just doing this. Uh, go ahead. Doing? Just go, get, hurry. Get, okay. I, mean, I just, is everything okay? Yeah, I'm sorry. Okay, you're good? My fault. Okay. So I'm here in Atlanta, but I perform oh, around Ricky. the world. I Ricky. speak about it and I talk about Ricky. it. And the cool thing is I not only love entertaining and teaching people how to do you okay? You all right? Yeah. You're good? You're good? What what are you doing with your shoe? What are you I doing? I don't know what I'm doing. Okay, okay. Well, let's leave it like that. Hey Andy. Yeah. Three, two, sleep. <laughs> Relax way back. Hi, Jennifer. Three, two. <laughs> Relax way back. Okay. Let's change it. Let's, let's kick it up a notch. Okay, let's. let's. I want to ask them what they're experiencing. Wouldn't you like to know? Yes. Would you like to know what's going through their mind during that whole thing? He's taking off his shoe. She's interrupting me. However, when I shake their hand, they won't be able to speak to me in English. They won't be able to speak at all in English. They'll only speak a language that does not exist. Okay? When I let go of their hand, they'll speak fine. No problem. But when I'm shaking their hand, they talk funny. By the way, Andy, when I ask you what your name is, your name is now Ron Burgundy. Whenever I ask you what your name is, you don't know why, but every time I ask you your name, you're Ron Burgundy. When I shake your hand, though, you talk in a funny language. Jennifer thinks it's hysterical, but yet it happens to her. One, two, three, open your eyes. Welcome back. Hi. Hey. How are you? Good. Any questions you want to ask them or, you know, what's going on through their minds? How are you guys feeling? I'm feeling, I'm still pretty relaxed. Good. Yeah. 
Andy, you know, thanks so much. Uh, by the way, um, how would you describe this to people listening and watching? How would you describe this? Uh, it's uh, um, really... <laughs> uh, it's uh, g g g g good. Okay, all right. Anyway, hi, how are you? Hey. And uh, how do you spell your name for me? J J J I'm sorry, I didn't catch your name earlier. Uh, my name's... Ron. Ron, nice to meet you, Ron. I, yeah. I didn't catch your last name. What was your last name? Uh, uh, Burgundy. Well, great. And how would you ex describe this? Uh, uh, yeah, yeah. Whatever. I'm sorry. I didn't catch your name earlier. This is Ron. Have you guys met? Here. Great. What was your name? Try. Try. John. And you can remember. What's your name? John, Jennifer. That's pretty awesome. Isn't that, that cool? Is incredible. Yeah. And you're not sure what's going on, do you? Yeah. And three, two, sleep. Relax way down. Deeper. Hi. Three, two. Relax oh. way down. All right. So just in a short amount of time, you can see how quickly simple words, simple suggestions can frame a whole new reality, yet not still challenging them moral ethically, but letting their mind take a little dream. A little daydream, if you will, and that's the cool thing. At the end of the day, when I open their eyes shortly, they're wide awake, they feel great, uh, they're going to brag about their experience, they'll remember their names, they'll speak clearly and distinctly. One, two, and three. Eyes open. Welcome back. Uh, your name is? Andy Cohen. Hi, Andy. Yeah. Your, your shoe. Right. <laughs> I'm on it. Okay. <laughs> Jennifer, your name is? It's Jennifer. Good. It's Jennifer. Yeah. Yes, <laughs> Double checking, checkered license. <laughs> so the key words that you used, yeah. what if I say those words in an hour? Let's Are they out. back there? Let's find out. I'm mm. kidding. I'm kidding. No, it's not going to work like that. <laughs> like, with us. No, yeah. <laughs> I'm a person. Anyway, right. no, uh, <laughs> I'm a person. Make me feel good. Uh, it, you know, not really, no. It's, it's what they wanted to do and what they want to experience. That's the cool thing. It, I, you know, to give them that little 15 minutes of just escape of reality is everything to me.